guys, welcome to another episode, the third episode of the Travel Astrology Packing Tips show. So yeah, you heard right, we're talking all about packing tips depending on your star sign. So if you've ever yeah, struggled with packing, maybe packing too much, packing too little, not packing on time, always being super stressed about it, you've come to the wrong you've come to the right place, not the wrong place. Um because yeah, here I'll be telling you depending on your star sign, what you should keep in mind and also maybe something that you could pack that would make your trip that little bit easier. So as always, we're separating them into elements, the episode, and today's episode are the earth signs. So we have Taurus, Capricorn and Virgo to talk about today. So if you're any of those star signs, continue watching. If you are not, make sure to check out the playlist on YouTube and yeah, find your star sign. I've already spoken about fire signs and water signs. So today, earth signs and next week, um, air signs. So yeah, depending on what you are, we will be talking about you at some point. Um, so listen up and maybe for your next trip, you'll be better prepared than for your last. Anyway, let's get started. So Taurus. So yeah, if you're if a Taurus, you might be a chronic overpacker. So Tauruses usually really are very determined and know what they want. Um, but you can actually also be a little bit stubborn. So yes, overpacking is in your nature because you sort of think, you know, you know everything um, and you know, okay, this is definitely what I need. But then at the end of the day, you probably don't need it. You probably don't need 10 shorts you might just need five for a weekend trip um so yeah just make sure that you don't end up with a super heavy overstuffed suitcase that would leave no room for souvenirs and would just be super annoying because tourists do love to travel so yeah just make sure to really sort of evaluate when you are packing and just leave out all the just in case items because Tauruses do really like to be prepared uh, so you you naturally sort of think okay I'll pack that just in case but a lot of the times you don't actually need whatever you think you might need and a Taurus craves a sort of very comfortable lifestyle so you don't want to I mean you're not sort of necessarily a luxurious traveler but you like everything sort of working your way um and you also don't really like sort of really uncomfortable and like draggy and super like long trips where it just feels a bit like oh so one tip would be to get like a super super good neck pillow which would mean that you can sleep very well on maybe the airplane or the bus or whatever you're taking and yeah that would really sort of ease your situation for sure um and next up we have the capricorn my sister is a capricorn um so capricorns are very very responsible um and sometimes also a little bit um not serious but they just yeah they like it in a certain way um and yeah you really like everything to be organized and you are usually very prepared um sometimes too prepared let's put it that way because you can just like overthink a little bit and plan a little bit too much um so before you pack just think about your destinations so just make sure that you're thinking okay where am i exactly going what am i exactly taking what do i need um and yeah just sort of not to waste the space in your suitcase so you might not overpack but you might not take what is necessarily like needed for that destination so you might think you know you might have a plan and you know exactly what you're packing um but yeah just sort of make sure that you think about okay what do i need and what for example can i not get at the destination so if you're for example going on quite a long trip to a certain place and you know okay there's a supermarket there i can just get a shampoo and conditioner there i don't need to pack it then why not do that it just would make your life a little bit easier and yeah, as a Capricorn, it can be sort of difficult to feel at ease, um, let's say, and you sometimes feel a bit uncomfortable in unfamiliar, unfamiliar situations and surroundings. So if you don't know the place very well, um, sometimes it's a little bit, yeah, 
not anxious but you're just a bit like okay careful um and yeah it would be amazing if you packed something that would sort of give you that bit of easing on your trip so that you would make sure that you have everything and that's for sure either like a bum bag or something like a you know you can get those hoodies or scarves where you can actually put things in like with a little zipper um just so you have all of your belongings at like just uh you know really close to you and you always know where they are and you don't you're not like searching for them um because yeah that would make your sort of trip as a Capricorn that much easier because you wouldn't you might be worrying about other things and you might be you know a little bit uneasy about some things but to take that sort of off your list that you don't have to worry about that that would be really really helpful for a Capricorn and and last but least we have the Virgo so yeah Virgos take pleasure in staying super organized um so yeah chances are that you are already an expert when it comes to packing um and you like to tell people that as well um and yeah so the sort of pros and cons of rolling or folding and what your dad taught you how to pack properly and um yeah you sort of really know you've probably watched a couple of youtube videos on it and yeah you have very sort of clear packing goals let's put it so you know exactly what you need to pack um so yeah even if you think you're super 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 organized there's always a little bit of um yeah room for improvement so amazing would be something like little packing cubes uh because that obviously means that everything in your suitcase is not just sort of um plonked in even if you're folding it very nicely and um, but packing cubes are just amazing i mean they make your life so much easier um and actually packing is not a, like a nice experience and also unpacking so when you're like i don't know when you're like on a trip and you have a backpack it's just so much easier to be like oh there's my cube of all my t-shirts uh rather than like rummaging around the whole bag looking for t-shirts um so yeah especially something maybe like one of those packing cubes that you can also like hang up so everything is like nice and nice and tidy if you're like at a hostel or something um and yeah just make sure to yeah keep organized even though like i said you probably think that you are 100% organized um and yeah planning a trip as a sort of like a very practical virgo because virgos are very practical um means sort of trying to pack smart um so you probably wouldn't take something that you won't absolutely need so you're not uh, like some of the other star signs that sort of you know think oh just in case i'll take a thousand things um but maybe just a tip on the side would be maybe something like waterproof bags so that you can definitely make sure that or maybe like cosmetics could be in those with this waterproof pack that in case they spill nothing else gets dirty or um wet or anything that would be cool or maybe definitely bring something that you can also if for example you, you're going on like a massive hike um and you're all, like sort of taking a smaller bag just make sure that inside is either for example waterproof or that you have a specific bag which keeps things waterproof um yeah it'll just make your life a little bit easier because you won't need to worry like constantly like oh what happens if and um you know just if you're going on like an adventure and it's rainy and cold um it's just like a really cool thing to have and make sure that nothing is super wet that was it guys i hope you enjoyed just a few packing tips as always i would really love to hear your yeah opinions like how your packing is going if you're going on a trip um and maybe you agree with some points maybe you absolutely disagree with some points um and yeah just let me know in the comment section or like uh subscribe obviously we would be super happy and check out other videos of my lovely colleagues as well and as always check out jomatrip.com to find your next amazing adventure bye guys